Master effects are a way to add one or more effects across Mixcraft's master output bus. This is really great for doing final mastering of a track, and it's usually used for compression, EQ, and limiting to give a final professional sounding polish to a track. The easiest way to add master effects is to click the effects button right here next to the master volume slider. You'll see the familiar effects list window that comes up with Mixcraft's other effects insert points. And you can choose an effect right here by pressing the down arrow. And I'm going to use Acoustica Compressor. And at that point you can choose a preset from the preset list. Or you can press edit and set the parameters to your liking. I'm going to choose a preset and since we're mastering I'm going to do a brick wall limiter. I can close the effects list window now. Now that we've added our compressor, let's listen to the track. If I click the effects button again, it'll bring the window up and I can bypass. And you can hear there's a pretty big volume difference. The master bus also lets you use the effect chains that we talked about in one of the earlier videos. You can access those right here, and you can see all the same presets come up. And in this case, we're going to use some of the mastering ones. Let's try this mastering preset right here. And we can sample different ones, of course, by clicking again and selecting. And you can disable individual effects by clicking in the boxes. Change the order by moving here. Or edit effects by pressing the edit buttons. And so forth. Enabling and disabling master effects is also accessible from the mixer by clicking the mixer tab and clicking the effects button right here. You can also jump directly to effects user interfaces by right clicking on any effects button. This right click shortcut works on all the effects buttons in Mixcraft.